Hello everybody, it's Joe Ditzel. We're back with another vlog. Back on my bicycle. Hey, this is an early morning ride. And I had to show you this church. I came upon and fascinated with some churches that I see in my meanderings on my bike. And I came across this little church that to me looks like it could be uh, 300 years old. <laughs> It's a stone church uh, in what I think is the Wineland Park area of Columbus. It might be the short north I'm not, or Italian village. I'm not 100% sure. But this little stone church you see on the left, first of all, to me, it looks like something you would see in the English countryside or uh, in a, the European countryside. And that it would be in a, some glen somewhere because it's so small yet it's rock solid, made from just <laughs> solid stone blocks, right? And just the simplicity of it, right? It doesn't have, a lot of churches have way too much ornamentation and design, whatever. It's just a simple stone church in a simple neighborhood in Columbus, Ohio. And uh, so who is this church? What? Church is this. Let me read from there. Let me. This is from churchomania.com. Did you know there was a website called churchomania.com? You didn't. This is St. Sophia Syriac Orthodox Cathedral at 1493 Indianola Avenue in Columbus, Ohio. And this little church has a lot of things going on. They operate a soup kitchen for the homeless and needy. They have a crisis center. They have a workplace development program and they have an inner city ministry now this church was founded in 2002 but the building has got to be much older than that right it's got to be uh so i don't know i couldn't find much history on the actual church building if you know anything about it uh leave some comments because i'd be fascinated to find out more about it but nonetheless the St. Sophia Syriac people have a lot of things they're doing for the community. And in fact, every morning I read they have a bagel and coffee breakfast for anybody that needs, you know, some, some a free meal, essentially, or a free bagel. Uh, that's just one of the simple things they do to help the community. And you heard all those others I talked about. And sure enough, as I rode by, you can hear all the activity. The door is open. And if you look inside, there's people getting free bagels. You know, and then I came upon this, the smallest, the tiniest, the smallest little bike that I've ever seen in my life. I supposedly written by, supposedly, uh, ridden by an adult. I don't know how they could possibly do that. But, uh, this little church fascinates me. The building uh, is so cool looking. And then they have so much going on for the Wineland Park area. Uh, kind of a neat little story. Just thought I'd share that with you folks. That really is all I have for this vlog. And as always, you can see my stand-up comedy uh, schedule at joeditzel.com slash schedule if you are interested in seeing where I'm going to appear and want to come to watch me do some of my dumb jokes live. So that's all I've got for now, folks. I hope you enjoyed that. Until next time, we'll see you then.